Nothing spoke to me more this week than when I read uh, a Hunger Games theme park is coming and somebody commented, I can't wait to die in a coal mining accident. <laughs> So I've been hacked. I haven't been hacked, but I feel like I have. Um, I've been targeted by an Instagram ad, and I've seen it a couple of times now, and I I cracked. I just I bought the thing. I like didn't even think about it. I was like, all right, yeah, I'm done. This is Sichuan Chili Crisp. You've probably seen a uh, Instagram ad for it. If you watch uh, you know shows like Hot Ones, where they're you know, or you've you know bought in hot sauces in the past. Um, this just really titillated me. It is chili crisp. So I guess there's like crispy bits in it. Or something like that. Anyways, it's they were showing videos of putting it on ice cream. So if, if that's the case, it must be good. And we're gonna try it right now. Yep, and now everybody's obsessed. Yeah, go. I love human food. Yum, 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 yum. I eat human food. Oh, wow. It smells great. This is essentially chili oil. Spoon some, uh, some chili oil out here. Oh, yeah, and there's, uh, there's bits. There's a lot of bits. You can't eat this, so you gotta get out of the video. Thank you. Oh, yep, just like the, the Insta ad. Just like the Instagram ad. Of course Dee wants to be in this video. She loves human food. Okay, not what I was expecting for some reason. I imagined it to, okay. It's like subtle flavor. I imagine it to be sweet for some reason, but I actually like this better. It's like just just good amount of spice. That's really good. This is a product review here, and you are impeding progress. This stuff is right up my alley. It's a savory, crunchy hot sauce that you find yourself putting on everything. I mean, it even says you can put it on vanilla ice cream. I have no ice cream in my house, so I can't really prove that. Mm. Okay. It's really like oily, but you gotta like scoop down to get the bits. And then it's just like Instagram. Wow. Yep, there's like kind of the spice bits. It's like, little seeds and, and I don't want to say nuts, but there's like little bits in there of spice powder. But yo, this, this stuff is bomb. This may be the new new. It's like little clumps of spice. So every time you bite into one, you get this like intense burst of flavor. $15, but after tax and shipping, it was $20. So I don't know what the going rate is for chili oil of this caliber, but I'll tell you what, it's really good. And uh, from the ad, it seemed like I was uh, supporting a small business, so. People are freaked out by like the algorithm, like, oh my God, like Alexa's always listening, or like, you know, your phone, when you get an ad for something you talked about. As far as the application goes, I mean, what's wrong with that? You talk about stuff that you like and wanna try, and then you get recommended things. I think that's such a bad thing. You literally, when you buy an iPhone or a computer or anything, you're buying a device that connects to the internet and has a microphone and a camera at all times. So it's like, I mean, what do you expect them to not utilize these tools? And hey, if you get to get connected by targeted ads, you know, they're targeted to you because it's stuff you want to maybe like and try and branch out and go stuff. Obviously, I'm trying to save money, but whatever. Top twenty dollars on chili oil because I I like the ad campaign. I mean, whatever. Is that gonna focus? Whatever. Am 
am I saying that I appreciate our uh, our technological overlords being able to, you know, manipulate me into buying things? Yeah.